the very first time, there was a brand new virus that had emerged into the human global population. And um, there were millions of people getting infected. And so it was, in a way, the largest experiment in human immunology. It was a boon for human immunologists like us, the community, that we could access samples, blood samples, mucosal samples, and analyze how the immune system responded to this brand new virus and how it continued to evolve with every successive variant of the virus that emerged and in this way have remarkable insights into how our human immune system responds. Uh, so that's, uh, it's been a tragedy at, at the level of public health and so many lives have been lost and so many people have fallen very ill. But on the other hand, in terms of COVID's gift to science, it's been a remarkable boon. And the data that's been generated by so many different labs across the world is, I think, it's going to be such foundational knowledge in the field of human immunology that for decades to come, that people will use this as a reference data set to benchmark how other viruses work and how, other vi how we respond to other viruses or vaccines. Mm -hmm.